Hi, welcome to Establish a Home with Shannon Hossfield. And this is where we believe that family is a fundamental unit of society and believe that as we strengthen home and family, that will positively be reflected into the world. Today I'm in my living room and um, where I am, it's really common for that to be a great room. My living room and my kitchen are connected into one big room. And so this is where a lot of living happens. We eat here, we make memories here, we connect, learn, um, just living happens in this space, okay? Um, so this is, and that's what I want to have happen here. And so I've been thinking, um, over the years, I've talked to different moms that have given me really great advice on how to make sure that my living room stays the place where we live and that we don't have distractions here. Um, and that the living room is where we promote what we value the most. And so we try to do that in our decorating and things, and I am not a decorator at all, but I did try to make sure that there were a few things in here so I could like reinforce what we care about the most. And so I have like a picture of Christ, and I have like pictures of my family over here on the wall, right? And then over here is my um, family mission statement and my education statement that I'll talk about someday. And then over here is where any normal person would put a TV here. Okay, my house was built like around this being a TV <laughs> and the people before us that lived here had a TV here. And so why don't I have a TV here? Well, really smart, amazing moms have advised me not to have a TV in the main living space of my home. And I've actually really loved it because it's so, for me, TV is just so distracting. And so I just don't want it here. <laughs> anyway, and I really, I wanted to have a piece of really fine art here, but I haven't found the picture that I love the best that I'm going to put here. Um, so if you have any like fine art ideas, can, like of pictures that you think would be great. Anyway, I just haven't found something that I really love. So instead I hang my children's fine art. Yes, you're loving all their adorable Christmas decorations. So yeah, this is where I put my kids' fine art. <laughs> um, and... So yeah, I don't have a TV here. And so if you don't have a TV in your living room either, can if you, even if you're watching the replay, it doesn't matter. Just put it in the comments below that you don't have a TV in your living room either. So everyone knows I'm not just a crazy person doing this on my own. Tons of people don't have a TV in their living room because they know it's distracting and takes away, it can be, from the actual living, okay? Um, what else do I want to talk about? I do have a TV in my house. Um, and I do want to be able to monitor what's on it. So it's in my basement and it's in the kids' playroom. And there are DVDs and VHSs that I have handpicked out that they can choose from to, um, to watch. And so it's not connected to any cable or anything like that. There's no TV shows that my kids can watch on the TV. They can only watch on there the DVDs and VHSs that I handpicked and already approved of. So when I say it's time to, that they, it's okay for them to go watch TV, I'm fine with it, whatever they pick out downstairs in that other room. Um, so let's see. So I wanted to know if you don't have a TV in your living room, please put that in the comments below. If you, um, have any questions about that or are thinking like, whoa, that would be a major sacrifice for me or, um, just, I don't know if you have any other thoughts on that, that's fine. You can ask, we're going to talk more about, um, computer and computers and iPads and Netflix and YouTube, like all these other things we're going to talk about more the other day. But today I want to know what's in your living room that's inspiring and reinforces the values that your family really cares about. What's in your living room? So tell me in the comments below, what's in your living room that reinforces your values and, um, and encourages the kind of living you want in your living room. Um, I also have a lot of books in my living room. Seeing this, I have three bookshelves. I didn't clean up before I did this video, so whatever. I have three bookshelves in my living room, so I have, that's also here. So what's in your living room that inspires learning and love and connection and, um, and maybe what did you take out? So please put that in the comments below. If this gives you some new ideas, give me some thumbs up and some shares and I'll see you later. Oh yeah. And of course, I'm wishing you all the best as you establish your home. Bye.